Cancer-causing chemicals have been found in drinking water just outside the city of Madison. Chloe Morrissey was in the neighborhood and spoke with residents about this news. Test results from Public Health Madison and Dane County show that PFOS levels have spiked in the Wabisa Beach area. Results conclude that 15% of private well tests came back with PFOS levels above the standard, which is 70 parts per trillion here in Wisconsin. Also called forever chemicals, PFOS is known to not break down easily, which is why it's used in things like firefighting foam and nonstick cookware, but also why it's so dangerous to humans. And what happens is that when you consume any kind of PFAS, it just stays in you. So it accumulates over time. And because it accumulates over time, that means their um, dangers can accumulate over time. These chemicals are known to cause cancer, low birth weights, and many other complications. Here on Wabisa Beach, residents say PFAS levels reach an extreme spike when they tested two years ago. And now with news of even more contamination, they say it's just unbelievable. Dean Baumgartner shares a well with his neighbors, and the four of them took part in PFAS testing two years ago. After seeing that spike, he thought of having a deeper well built. The county notified him that PFOS was even found in these deeper wells too. Now he relies on reverse osmosis. We can only use that on a few of our, our faucets, but we're very careful about which water uh, we drink from. Right next door, Jenny and Josh McIntyre, who say the situation is very concerning. Jenny was home earlier today, but declined an on-camera interview. She says that if they would have known the water was this contaminated, they would have never moved to the area. Jenny says this news is terrifying and frustrating, but says they've learned to live with it. Her real concern lies with her children who come to visit and the potential effects PFOS contamination could have on them and future generations. In the town of Dunn, Chloe Morrissey, 27 News.